Hey guys, what's up? Baby to you here and Xavier. Um yeah, I probably should have let him. But anyways, so kind of a funny glitch. And then okay, we jump into it and there's nothing that happens to it. And then this also kind of looks like it was seriously naturally spawning at. Um So yeah, it looks really cool in my opinion. There's there's not really a cave oops, cave system. All right. Now, oh my gosh, that is cool. I did not even think of that. Ow, I failed. Like you did on the first try. All right, but anyways. So yeah, there's that and then Xavier also with his magicalness just found a zombie spawner and I wrote down the teleport coordinates for that. Well, sort of. I actually just came from right there, like I teleported there. So I'm actually going to find that document that has them. Um, WordPad, um, open 2013, cool stuff. I just named it that. Alright, so that's where the water glitch is, and that's where the zombie spawner is. 276, okay, slash TP, bay by TU, 276, 63. I remember that much, and then 266, alright. So there we go. Okay, I did this wrong. I did something wrong. I don't know where I am. 276 and 266, that's exactly where it says to be. And then it says 63. I'm in the extreme hills. No, I'm not. It's just completely glitched up. Alright, it just sent me right under where it was, which is really weird. Alright, what is the Y to this? 68. So did I type it in wrong? I probably typed it in wrong. Um, yeah, I did 63. Why did I do 63? I probably said 63. No, I didn't. Well, I, I said it, but never mind. Alright, so anyways, Xavier is off exploring, and I did a little exploring of my own at the house. Um, oh yeah, and that's a really weird, like, if you see right in the corner, like, if you look right there, there's this weird little tree that decided to spawn there, but anyways, um, I was trying to find a nether fortress, so, you know, didn't really work out too well, you know, crap, I'm gonna get lost, Xavier, just so you know, just so you know, ow. Alright, but anyways, so this is actually right next to where, um, this place is, the place where I found the, is that a sheep? No, that's a cow, never mind. This stuff. Oh, Xavier's gotta go for a second really fast. Um, but anyways, this is where I was mining that one time, a long time ago. So yeah, um, that's really what this episode is mainly going to be about, so I'm going to try to get home. I'm actually going to burn a few cows on the way home. Um, let's set fire there. Come on, please. Burn. Please. Burn. Thank you. Now, close these before they catch anything else on fire. Please don't go in the water, by the way. Did you really die? Yes! Come on. Go into the fire. You know you want to. I guess I do have wheat. Oh, hey. You just kind of came to me. Thank you. Oh, except... Okay, yeah. Hold on, let me um, turn that off. Alright. So we're just going to burn a few cows. And if you want to skip to the next episode, if the next episode is up, then you may do that. If it's not up, then I am recording this, or then you are watching this on the first day of February. I just realized that. And I don't know if I'm going to. P.S. It's the 25th of January that I recorded this on. Or am recording this on or whatever. I think I just found a plane that's biome Xavier. 
Yes, I just found a plains biome, Xavier. Hopefully it is big. Let's see. Alright, X is 460. Oh, yeah, it's not too big. It's really not very big, but 460 and 200. So, yeah, but anyways. Um, just burning cows, really, for most of this episode. Oh, you found... Get a cactus for me, please. Thank you. He just found a cactus thing. He is so much better at finding crap than me. Like, I don't know what the deal is. It's probably because he can use Farsight, but... Whatever. Okay, you know what, Cal? I'm gonna burn you no matter what. You are going to burn. Ow, and so am I. Apparently. Alright. Crap, that almost killed our flint and steel. And they have like 60 uses or so. How did you die so fast? You must have like fallen from a tree or something. Alright, yeah, this isn't gonna be too interesting of an episode. Let's see, we're at 6 minutes. So yeah, hopefully I won't do anything like this ever again. Like, something this boring. I'm actually going to find a place quick as possible. Actually, night is coming on pretty fast, so we could have a fun time with mobs or something. I don't know. Oh, hey. Holy crap! Xavier, look at this. Look at how much freaking iron there is right here. Come on, I took a picture. Thank you. That's quite a bit of iron. Quite. Alright, but anyways. Guess we might be mining. Oh man, that just fell a little bit. Um... Let's do that. And we'll take the water. Oh, and then we'll take the water again, apparently. Alright, you know what, whatever. Oh gosh, ow. I actually have almost no means to light this place besides that. How did I get bread? Oh, that's probably from the zombie spawner. So yeah, oh wow. This is pointless. This cave is practically dumb. Well, it is dumb actually. I don't know why I'm doing that. Oh, this is by the... Are you serious? I think I just found another zombie spawner. I seriously think... Where are you? Shouldn't be a big surprise. Yeah, but already? Like... Andrew, remember that one time we had like five zombie spawners? In like five minutes? Yeah, and guess how spread apart they were. Who okay. hit? Oh. Hey. And they might not even be zombie spawners. Nope, it's a zombie spawner. I'm sure of it. Ow. So yeah, it is up. I'm gonna actually have to kill this guy. Where did you come from? Oh crap. Um. Okay, yeah, we should probably end off the episode right here. Hopefully, I won't die while I'm ending off the episode, so I'll end it off kind of fast. But yeah, I won't do any more that are this boring. I'm sorry that this one was kind of boring. Um. If you got any suggestions, then leave them in the comments below, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.